Give me chance to respond because I'm Muslim. You, are, you have said a lot about Islam. Do you understand? Sir, you have to be honest. Give me favor. Give me favor. Give me favor. Give me favor. You went to that time. Put, put the victimhood and the crybaby politics to one side. Do you understand? I'm speaking factually to you. And I've asked you at each stage, if I'm wrong, then correct me. My argument then is this. What religion, what were the two main religions? I'm not talking about what Muhammad's people, the Quraysh, were, were, were worshipping, because we knew they were pagans. Yeah, we absolutely know that as a statement of fact that they were pagans. So, what were the two dominant religions in that area of the world at that time? It's the Jude, Judaism and the, uh, in that world, in that time. Yeah, Actually, is, uh, is, uh, in that, that particular place was, uh, I believe, is, was the paganism. Because these 360 idols, all the Arab those living around used to come there to worship. This is a big festival. Okay. So, 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 so in the so, Arabia, in Arabia, so, that time, the biggest so, religion so was... Speaking, so yeah. speaking truthfully is difficult for you, so I'll answer the question for you. No, no. Yeah, it's difficult for no, you. No, I'm, I'm truth, telling, I'm so telling hold on you one the moment. Truth. Hold on, hold on. You cannot tell me hold another on. religion sir, existed sir, that time. Sir, the main religion that, in the Arab. I said, which were the two predominant religions at the time? Let me tell you how I know the answer. Are you mean that area or the world at that time? Speaking about in, Arabia, in Arabia, Arabia. Uh, that, or that uh, that place that uh, we call Arabia. Just hold on a minute. I'm going to answer it for you, okay. just so we, we I can don't, cut I the time. Don't know. Well, I'm going to tell you. I'm going to tell you. I'm going to tell you, and then I'm going to use I'm going to use Islam to prove what I say. Okay. The two predominant religions in that area of the world at the time was Judaism, you understand, and Christianity. Those were the two predominant religions. What do you mean by dominant? Because no 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 we, we want to make why I why I use the, the why wait wait I'm gonna explain to you, you, I, I you ask the question no, let me explain no, it to you okay. simple <laughs> dominant meaning those which were the biggest religions okay. in that uh, in that by numbers the biggest religion the dominant in, by numbers in terms of influence at that time was Judaism and Christianity. Okay. Let me tell you how dominant. Do you know is. how many Judaism and Christianity were there? Because the pagans, 360 idols. Every community has an idol around the Kaaba. That's the all Arab used to come there pilgrimage. Do you let me, understand that? Let me just That's say a to big you. people. Let me just say to you. First and foremost, first and foremost, you're speaking about the Arabs. I'm yeah. speaking about the religions that were dominant. I'm okay. going to prove it to you if you okay. keep quiet for 20 seconds. I'm going to prove I to you. Am what the dominant religion was and Islam will prove that what I'm saying is true. When Muhammad, when Muhammad allegedly ran out of the cave and he went to Warika yeah. or his wife, whichever, you choose, I don't mind. And he went and he went to Warika. Do you know what Warika said? He said, you have just been spoken to by the angel Jibrail, which is Gabriel. What religion was Warika? Huh? What religion was he? Uh, he was uh, he was a Christian. He was a Christian. Oh, hold on. So he would have read the Christian books. Definitely, he was a Christian. Hold on, hold on, hold on. He was the main. Sorry, main just answer your son main, no. Uh, answer your son no. Yeah. Was he a Christian? Yeah. That's the only reason. Yeah. yeah that he knew that it was the age. No, I agree, sir, with, hold on, I agree hold on. with you. Christianity was there. I that's it. That's, that's it. And so and so I'm and so Islam you. unwittingly makes my point very very clear yeah, I agree with you. that suppose let's just say for example let's bring it down kindergarten time let's say that worker wasn't there at the time what would he have said had happened who would have spoken to him uh, that, that, that's, that's, uh, uh, are you saying no 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 wait, no, 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 no no you see you are you are that's no, you are rebuking me now no, you are rebuking no, that's no good that. you are saying yeah, you see yeah. you should apologize to the camera no 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 face to the camera you apologize to me I apologize, big brother. It's a joke. It's a little so, bit of satire. So, it's a little so bit of joking. So, this, this, uh, we love you, bro. So, you are assuming... Sorry, if, I'm if, not assuming anything. You are assuming. Everything that I've told because, you is factual. Because he went to Waraka. If Waraka was a Jew, he would have went to the Jew. If Waraka... That's why you're assuming. I cannot answer you that. For me, for me, he went to his wife. His wife took him to Waraka because Waraka and his wife are related. Do you understand that? He went to his wife, 
and then the wife took him to Waraka. You won't agree that, but I, we both agree they went to the... No, 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 no. We both agree they went to, to, went to Waraka. So, do you understand? I don't care who he went to. It yes, was but, Waraka. Hold on. Yes. It was Waraka that told him that it was the angel. Yeah, yeah, I agree with you. Do you understand, do you understand the implications of that? The implications are this, is that the God that you speak about, Alas Motala, who I say was not heard of. Yeah, he was not heard of. You're going to say exactly. that the Quraysh... That's why I wanted to ask you the word Abdul Ghai. The word Allah. Is that... You know you're answering my question. Sir, sir, can I just say to you? All Allah so, means... Are you saying that time no Allah existed? All Allah means... All Allah means... She was, she was the Greek goddess, the Aphrodite. No, the word Allah. Allah. No, no. no Allah. And, and it was the moon god as well. Yeah? As I said, it was Allah. The question that you can't answer me is simply this, which is why I don't like having long conversations with Muslims. You, you have been... Sir, yeah, yeah. no, no, only to expose, on, only to expose the fallacy of your argument. Okay. I'm saying to you, I'm saying to you that if Muhammad was named at birth Muhammad ibn Abdullah, slave of Allah, and yet the term Allah was Allah yeah. was not in wide use in Arabia at that time. His parents were futurologists. Okay. You understand? Yeah. Or they knew something okay. that we didn't know. Well, you think about it. How can you okay, be a slave? I tell you something. Hold on one moment. How can you be a slave of something that okay. doesn't exist okay. yet? I, I tell them something. I tell yeah. them something. You only heard no, no. the term no, no. Allah. Yeah. You yeah. only heard the term yeah. Allah. Yeah. Well, hold okay. on. You only heard the term yeah. Allah. Yeah. Only heard it yeah. 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 after yeah. the so-called yeah. conversation no, 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 that no, Muhammad no, no. had. I will answer you that. No, 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 wait. So I, I will answer you that. You said that, you said that, you said that, is Abdullah, our prophet's name is Muhammad. That's a single name, not two names. Muhammad. Muhammad ibn Abdullah. Why, why, wait, wait, wait. No serious Muslim. No, no, you wait. There is no serious Muslim. You promise me you wait. There is no serious Muslim. No, no. I challenge any Muslim around here. Tell me that that's not that is not true. Wait, uh, you are speaking Arabic. When you say Muhammad ibn Abdullah, it's not English. Do you know the meaning of those three words? Abdullah, Muhammad ibn Abdullah. You know these three meanings. They are Arabic. They are not English. You, to know this, you need to understand the Arabic language. Do you understand? You are speaking Arabic now. It's not English. When you say Muhammad, it's not English. Ibn is not English. Abdullah is, is four words. They are not English. Muhammad ibn Abdullah. You, what does it mean? Sir, just one moment. It means slave of Allah. You, no, yep. no. Sir, it I'm, means Muhammad, sir, son sir, of sir, sir, Abdullah. Sir, sir. Ibn means son. So the, his father's he name. He's the son of a slave. Exactly. Well, well let me just explain exactly. this to you. The Allah that they're speaking about, yeah. that Muslims speak about, did not exist well, at that time. Why is the father of Muhammad? Sir. Why is the father of Muhammad? Sir, the name I, of the sir, father. I don't care. No, I'm asking you. Yeah? No, I'm going to tell you because this is diversion. You understand? I'm asking stick, you. Stick to the point. I, I'm sticking the, the point. The point is Be simply this. Because Listen, you don't point, understand my point. You carry on speaking. So, yeah? Abdullah, speaking. Abdullah okay, means slave you don't want to accept the truth, bro. Allah. Let Abdullah. Let me just say to you. You're not listening. They send Muslims. They send He's Muslims. Not they send Muslims to speak. Yeah, who, who, are not, who are not very educated. No, no. Who sent me? You, no, brother. Are, you, are are now. Are you are now. You are lying now. You are lying. Yeah. You are lying. Yeah. Who sent me? You, are, you were are, here when I came. About four people were here. Do you understand that? They raise their voice. Anytime anyone comes with a logical argument, they raise their voice. They raise their voice. This time, and they change. No, 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 no. We are four people. All the time. All one so what I'm going to do now? Is, is I'm going to turn I, my back on you. No, no, and I'm going to speak no, no, to somebody. No, 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 no. I thought you are. You, I thought you are. I've been listening no, no, about twenty minutes. I don't have to talk no, to you. No, no. You, 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 you don't. Have to, you don't. You don't. But you just lie. You can't. You can't run me over. No, I understand. I understand. But you are being honest. You are not being honest. I'm talking about you are not being honest. Can I just say to you? You are not being honest. Yeah. If Muslims, if Muslims wishes to follow their faith in the way in which they will, they can. What they cannot do, 
which is what they seem to misunderstand because they do not understand the concept of free speech. They do not understand people who think about truth outside of the confines that they no, give no, to people. They will say to people, for example, they will say that in Islam there is no compunction. If there is no compunction in religion and there is no compunction in Islam, then why then do you behave the way in which you do? Because you see, one of the problems that most people have here is that they speak about Islam without understanding it. How then do they deal with somebody who does understand it? You understand? Who did follow it? You understand? Who speaks a great deal of that language? Islam, as practiced, is nonsensical. In as much the same way that if you say that you are a follower of the Baha'i faith, you can follow that. I actually think that's nonsensical. But you have a right to follow that. What you don't have a right to do is to tell me that I have to follow it. Yep. And if I don't, there may well be a chance yep. that I might get hurt yep. if I don't follow it. It's nonsense. Ooh. Nonsense. Total nonsense. No, no, no. Pardon? Because you can tell Why not? We mean why not? Hold on, hold on. Why not? 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 You have a right, this is the concept that most Muslims can't get their heads around, you have a right to believe what you wish to believe. You don't have a right to tell me that I should believe as you believe. I don't believe what you believe. What about if I feel like my religion is, is something noble? Don't you think Pardon? If I believe in something that's noble, Look, don't you think Let me just say to you, you know, when, when my father was alive, my father used to say to me... Keyword was mine. <laughs> My father used to say yeah. to me, my, anytime, my. Someone, anytime a religious person yeah. opens their mouth, they're trying to sell you something. You understand? And what it is, most Muslims, if they're honest, and there are very few honest Muslims that I've met, and that's just the truth. I'm just telling you the truth. You understand? Most of the Muslims that you meet, they will tell you, if they're honest, yeah, what their aim is. And they say this. If you were to say to a Muslim, but well, why don't you go back to your own country? They say that the whole world belongs to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Yeah, this is what they say. The whole world belongs to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Yep. They will tell you on one hand that they believe, they will tell you on one hand, they will believe in peace. You understand? And how they do it. And yet this man, all he did, he had a conversation with a man, and then all of a sudden, he went from Mr. Pius yeah, to God F yourself. Yeah, get F and C. You understand what I'm saying to you? So, on one hand, on one hand, they preach this tolerance, yeah, that their book has never preached. Do you understand? I don't believe in it. I don't believe in it anymore. I don't. But well, hold on a second. First and foremost, I'm not even speaking to you. Yeah? And I'll tell you the reason why. I'll tell you the reason why. When I was in China, when I was in China, here's another Muslim now dressed up in his religion. Just God, yeah, because wait, the world is a stage. Wait, 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 wait. Yeah, I said you can. I said you can. I said that you're allowed. Did anybody hear what I said? Yeah. Yeah, you're allowed to practice whatever you want to practice. Yes. I'm just making a statement. I'm going to tell you. I'm going to tell you because because it's a close. I'm not. I'm speaking generally. This guy, this guy turned. This guy, it's, it's, it's on YouTube. I was sitting down in Chengdu in China, and I heard this guy say to a guy, "Don't speak to me. You're a batty man. Yeah, you're a batty oh, man." man. Yes. And now all of a sudden yeah. you're going to come and speak. I'm just telling you what I saw. Yeah. This is the same man that said. To I, they said to a man, hold on, Sarah, hold on one minute. I've once been, I've, listen, I've once telling the truth or I'm not telling the truth. Let's just stand on the truth. Stand on the truth. Then the man says, then the man says, then the man says to a man, I've been in jail, yeah, and where I come from, if somebody speaks about the prophet, yeah, he knows man them who shot them. They can talk like that to man them who are some idiots. Do you understand? They can chat to man like that who's idiots. What if you're not an idiot? Then you're going to have to back that talk up. You're going to have to back that talk up. And this is what I'm saying to you. My view, my view, and I'll say it again, I'll say it again. If you wish to be Muslim, that is fine. I'm not here to tell you you shouldn't be Muslim. Yeah, if you want to be Christian, I'm not here to tell you that you're not to be Muslim. But most people don't understand that what they do Hyde Park is not what Hyde Park was. Hyde Park, as I said, has become an open-ear mosque and what they wish to do is to come here every week and proselytize. There is nothing wrong with that, but I don't accept it. Me neither. And so certain people who come with that wicked talk and tell people that a man's going to get shot in they can't chat to me. And boy, That's true. Yeah, big brother. can't chat to me. can't chat to me. Stop. Stop. You don't know what democracy is. Come on. I'm sorry. So don't worry. Don't run, don't run. You're going to talk me down. I'll bring that noise.
Somebody and the first thing that this person says is, hold on, hold on, you are a batty man, you are a batty man. I'm not trying to. You can say what you want. Never speak, never speak. I don't want to conversation. Why don't you? What are you running for? Speak to me. Speak to me. You're a coward. No, 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 no. You're a coward. No, 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 no. Where's the camera? No, no, no. I want my face. Shoot, shoot, shoot. I know I'm not. No, no, don't do that. I'm not here to. Brothers, we don't need you. 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 Brothers, we don't need you.